I work in real estate and I was not able to take a maternity leave with either child. When I had my son, it was in the beginning of the pandemic. So, uh, you know, lockdown happened, everything became virtual. So I was able to bring him with me to every single thing for the first six months. And then I would do work while the baby was napping. I do the same thing now with my daughter. I didn't have any help with her until like seven, eight months in. And now that I own a brokerage, I can work from home but I do have to work, like I can't just stop working. I can't just like not work for three months. Same thing with my husband. We both own our own businesses. So we both just mentally understood like, okay, we're both gonna have to take a significant amount of like hours during the week, but not necessarily days off. Especially because I do content creation also, it can be really difficult to identify like which things to spend time on, honestly, because Anytime that I'm not with the babies, it's like, all right, how do I crunch as much out of these hours as I possibly can? I'm not going to lie, it can get a little bit disheartening, like, when you kind of feel like you're running up a hill and then you keep, like, like sliding down. Like, that's kind of how it feels being a working mom sometimes. It feels like everyone's just kind of, like, passing you and you're just, like, struggling to get a few hours out of the day just to get the things done that you need to get done. Aside from creating content, real estate is definitely like a 24 seven business. The biggest issue is like when you have calls and stuff like that, just being able to find like quiet space to do those calls is can be really a challenge. But the flexibility gives you the ability to have more time with your kids in ways because it's not a nine to five, you're not clocking in, you don't need somebody watching them from nine to five, but not having help, it can get really overwhelming. The thing too with real estate is you get out what you put in so you can put in a million hours into it but like when your kids are young you obviously have that internal conflict of like I don't want to be spending all of my time working when they're young if I don't have to. However in real estate if you just stop working for three months or stop working for six months it can be detrimental to your career honestly like I, I haven't experienced it but I can't imagine like taking like a full three months off of my job it would just I don't even know what would happen I think most people now that a lot of people are working from home are experiencing similar things especially even if your kids are in school like they get sick you got to work from home uh, you have to make a lot of adjustments as a parent working in this time like you're just and but I do feel like people are more understanding of those situations and of people working from home so it's kind of like a we're all in this together vibe. Congratulations on the baby and good luck to you.